All right, guys, so this is the car that we were supposed to be in, but there's a much cooler car that I think is even closer to Santa, and I'm wondering if maybe we could sneak on it. We totally need to sneak on it. In today's vlog, we ride the Polar Express. But before we get started, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Guys, guess what time it is? It is Polar Express time. Every December, Steve and I pick a random day in the month to surprise the kids with one of these. We hide these tickets somewhere in the house, they find it, and then that means that they are riding on the Polar Express. So earlier in the day, I hid their tickets around the house and they are home now from school. They just got home, they're working on their homework and then they will start finding their tickets and then we will head on out to the Polar Express. Hey Steven, I need you real quick. I need you. Please shut the door. You need to start making your bed better. Please go make it. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. Hey Taylor. Hey Taylor, come here real quick. In that drawer, I need you to open it and I need you to get out the lip stuff. Chapstick and put some chapstick on. Is that a prank? No, not a prank at all. Uh, the upper one, I put chapstick on the upper one. Peyton. Hey Peyton, I need you real quick in your room. Okay, so I need you to get on socks because the ones you had were really, really smelly. Please get a different pair, please. What? What you, what? I need you to get a different pair of socks, please. Jordan, I need you real quick. Jordan, can you fix the snowman over there, please? I saw you touching it earlier and I want you to fix it. The back of it's all messed up. Inside the stocking, it's just a mess. Mommy needs you. Hey Parker, do you want to read a book with me? Yeah. Okay, let's read this book. You want to open it? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> what is that? Christmas. Christmas? It's your Polar Express ticket. Everyone grab their Polar Express tickets and let's go. <laughs> Where are you guys going? The Polar Express! All right guys, we are officially in the car and we have hit the road, but a Polar Express trip would not be the same without watching the Polar Express movie. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Woo! Woo, 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 woo! North, North Pole, Eureka! Are you going to be cold there? All right, the movie is just about over and guys, we have arrived at the North Pole. Yeah. yeah! It's so cool at the North Pole. There's a Polar Express! All right guys, so this is the car that we were supposed to be in, but there's a much cooler car that I think is even closer to Santa, and I'm wondering if maybe we could sneak Totally need to sneak on it. All right, guys, everyone has gotten on the train and we're sneaking up to the front. Don't tell. We're gonna try to sneak into the coolest car on the train. Let's just hope that we don't get caught. I better get on too. 
We totally snuck on the train. Oh my gosh, guys. We were able to sneak onto the coolest car of the so train. It's so nice in here. I think we shouldn't be here. I think it's Santa's train. <gasps> oh no. How did he oh, get no. out? How did you get out of here, Uncle Derek? No. He's locked in. Can't get him out. He's going to fall off the train. Hurry. Let him in. Get him, Taylor. Get him. Get him in. Hurry. He's trapped, guys. Oh, 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 oh shit. Did you say Santa's daughters? I almost slipped. Guys, all of a sudden, Santa's daughters showed up, guys. And we're having a dance party. And we don't want to get caught and thrown out. So guys, we need to look like Santa's elves, okay? Everyone grab a hat. So it's kind of nice. Get on the hat. Okay, perfect. I don't think you're gonna get noticed, okay? I am eight tall. They said they're elves. Eighteen? We'll hide in here so we don't get caught. Okay. There are rooms everywhere in this thing. There's dining room tables, there's couches, there's beds, there's sofas. What's your elf name? My elf name is Twinkle. You'll go down in history. I think Santa's coming on. Santa Claus coming. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Well, bless my soul. Look at all these wonderful children. If you take it out of the sack, it works a lot better. But it's really pretty in the sack. What's one thing you would like me to bring you on Christmas Eve? <laughs> well, that's reasonable enough. That's for you. And what's one thing you would like me to bring you on Christmas Eve? <laughs> one of everything? Yeah, you bet. I can't believe Santa's here right now. A stuffed animal panda. Oh, Merry Christmas. Come and tell me what one thing you want me to bring you on Christmas Eve. Mermaid fin? Merry Christmas. What's one thing that I can bring you on Christmas Eve? A lump of coal? <laughs> oh, well, you know, if you sit on it long enough, it'll turn into a diamond. Merry Christmas. What's one thing you'd like me to bring you on Christmas Eve? A big lollipop with yeah. a swirly in the middle? Yeah. Oh, we might have to look for one of those, but I'm sure we can find one. Merry Christmas. What would you like me to bring you on Christmas Eve? A Nerf gun. What's an orange Nerf One that shoots ra rapidly? Oh, okay. Merry Christmas, Santa. Oh, no, he's leaving. Merry Christmas. Santa. Uh-oh, Santa's coming back. Don't tell him. Hurry, go tell him he's coming back. Just say one thing. She knows what she wants to know. Well, that sounds very doable. Very Christmas. <laughs> what did you ask for? Not telling. Guys, we are on the back of the train. There's nothing out there but darkness and snow. And the North Pole. And Santa Claus! By the we came to the North Pole, we saw Santa, we got bells, and now we're heading back. This is awesome! 
Guys, I cannot believe that we are totally riding on the back of a train right now. It's totally like the Polar Express. It's the real Polar Express, Mom. <laughs> All right guys, so as we are heading back, I thought that it would be an awesome idea to play a quick game of hide and go seek for the first time ever on Santa's special train. Are you ready to play hide and go seek? It's a dance off between Steven and... Gingerbread. Gingerbread, let's go! Ready? Wait, before we start, I want to have a clean dance off, all right? No spitting. No profane dance moves, right? Looking at you, gingerbread is fine. Okay. Ready? Steven. All right, dance off. May I suggest the one where he goes like this? <laughs> oh, you have to you have shake your leg. Shake your leg. Oh, there we go. All right, Steven, I'm going to go once and he goes down. Point. Ready? Right. So good. So good. I'm so proud of you. So good. I can't do that. It's time for me to go find everybody. Where are they? Hmm. Where did anyone go? Doesn't look like anyone's in this room. But guys, there's like stuff. There's all kinds of stuff everywhere. Have you seen anyone? I haven't yet. I'm gonna find them before Guess you. Guess what? Do. There's a door right here. Nope. That would have been a perfect hiding spot, guys. Okay. No Let's check in here. Let's see. <gasps> oh! oh. <What? laughs> I have three people in one? Awesome! Yes! Guys, there's a door right here. It's locked. All right. I'm coming. Uh -huh. Let's see. Oh, man, she found me. I found you. Sorry. Not a very good hider. Yeah, I'm not very good. I'm sorry. Huh? What is it? I don't know. I think I found someone. Kind of blends into the. It's Uncle Derek. Dang it. Not a good hider at all. But guys, I can get in now. Is anyone in here? Yeah, oh my I'm goodness. This is scary. Nope, no one's in there. Where is everybody? This is kind of weird. I still have a lot more people to find. And now I'm in the dining room. This is the last room, guys. And I don't see anyone. There's a big dining room table. And then, oh, my, um. I didn't even know you were hiding, Steve. I thought if I snuck in late, I'd win. Wait a minute, I'm missing quite a few people. Yeah! I think there's someone else. And Peyton! <laughs> Guys, I think I found everyone but Steven. Where's Steven? Let me proudly escort you to the winner of Hide and Go Seek. The winner of Hide and Go Seek? I is? hid here, and Steven hid under here at first. No! He was right here at first, then he discovered that. Where are you? Do you see me? No! Look. Oh my goodness, how did you get under there? I, I don't even know. I'm the best hide and seek player ever. And that's how you play hide and go seek on the Polar Express. The question for the day is, have you ever went to the North Pole? Subscribe to our channel. Comment below. Give us a big thumbs up. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.